I'm Simona Barca, your Nameplate reporter in College Station. It's crawfish season, but last year's drought is impacting this year's crawfish supply. I spoke with a local live supplier who says because the supply is about half of what it was last year, the prices are double. A delayed crawfish season this year. The drought, the drought killed them off. Brandon Stass has been the general manager at the Crawfish Hole and College Station for seven years, so he's used to the ebb and flow of the crawfish business. I think I heard that there was somewhere in the neighborhood of about 100,000 acres that weren't fished. Their supply sank. Normally by, by this time, by March, uh, you know, we're probably going through anywhere from two to 400 sacks a week. This week, they've gone through 150 to 200 bags, half of what it was last year. With the supply being down as it was, uh, prices came up. The sunken supply is now sinking buyers' wallets. Easily, I would say, in the seven years that I've been doing it, it's the highest prices I've ever seen. This week, we're kind of around $7 a pound. Uh, this time last year, we were in that $354 a pound range. So it's a, it's a significant difference. It's about, about $100 a sack more expensive this year compared to last. But Stas says with the later round of crawfish, things are starting to look up. Uh, we are starting to see some recovery though, so we're at the point now where we can supply a good number of the restaurants in town. We're not quite at the point where we can sell to the public yet. And with more crawfish crawling in. And as that supply goes up, the price will go down. Brennan says the supply seems to be recovering, so they may be able to sell to the public even in the next few weeks. Reporting in College Station, I'm Simona Barca.